Today, we are going over the new Quest Trade Edge platform. Everything seems to be pretty much the same except for this new tool, which I am absolutely loving. So, after we get through the intro, we'll be breaking it down and I'll be letting you know how I use this tool as kind of a trade affirmation or just a little bit of comfortability when I go to make a new position. But if this is your first time here, my name's Nick. Welcome to Waste to Wealth. Huge favor, huge ask. If you learn something new or you get some value out of the video, hit that like button for me. And if you haven't already, please consider hitting that subscribe button and turning that notification bell on. We will jump into Quest Trade Edge. I got the update to download something new. I was excited for something amazing to pop up. And you know what? It's pretty much the same as before. So I just decided to go around, start looking, start researching, figuring out what is new with this uh, platform here. And what I found was this amalgamation, this um, partnership that they have with tip ranks. Now tip ranks is a site that I've been using on the side for a couple months now, and it gives you analyst expectations. It also gives you some information, more information about the company. And I was surprised to see that they had added this into quest trade edge and it made me very, very happy. So if you do have this already, you can come up to this top bar here on the right hand side. You should see something by the name of stock analysis. We're going to click it. It's going to pop open right here. And this is what it looks like. So we already see the Canadian National Railway is in here right now. .to signifies that it trades on the Toronto Stock Exchange. An analyst consensus has it at a moderate buy. You can also see how much upside it has listed right here in this percentage, which is based on the last traded price. And it gives you an indication here of how many buys, how many holds, and what certain analysts are saying. And you can see here that some analysts have different star grades. And these star grades represent the success rate. So we can see here that Jordan's success rate is 31 out of 53 recommendations at positive returns in the following year. We can also see if we just extend this out a little bit, there is a lot of coverage. We can also see that the average return that Jordan had in the past year is 11%. So obviously you want a little bit of uh, comfortability that these people know what they're doing to go take a look at some of the five stars to see what kind of price targets they have. Now that's not the only thing, it also shows news. So it gives you a sentiment based on what they're seeing in the market. It also gives you some headlines for that stock. But my favorite part here is the smart score. Now the smart score takes into account so many different things. We have analyst ratings, which we just looked through. We have tip ranks, investors. So what the tip rank community is saying about it, it also looks through blogger opinions and, and sees what the average sentiment is across the market. Are people saying good things? Are they saying bad things? It also takes a look at the news. It looks at hedge fund activity. So we see with uh, Canadian National Railway, they have 573,000 shares added to hedge funds over the past quarter. The technicals look good. There is momentum behind it. Uh, looking at the 20 over 200 day moving average. But we also see that insiders have been selling shares. So I know a lot of people don't like to see that. But it is good to see in this information in Quest Trade that you can go to a certain area and see this information. So let's take a look at Facebook just for another quick example. So just typing in the ticker symbol up here at the top, clicking into Facebook, it's going to remain on the tab that you started off with. And we see here it's a strong buy, average price target $422. Uh, tip ranks loves it. Bloggers love it. The news is definitely bearish right now, especially in front of Congress. Hedge funds are dumping this at a mass pace. Technicals look good. There's no insider activity. 
and fundamentals look pretty good. Let's take a look at the analysts. They have it as a strong buy, 25 buys, four holds, one sell. And these analysts here do work for pretty reputable companies. Now, obviously, you know, the stock market is unpredictable in that sense, but this company obviously, and, and this whole tip ranks is to be used as solidification or confirmation bias that there are some people that feel the same as you obviously not every single one's a winner especially when you look at some of these guys rankings but um, it's definitely a tool that I've been using to make some purchases this week on a little bit of market volatility but I uh, hope you enjoyed this quick little walkthrough of the new tip ranks that has been added to quest trade edge I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're still with me, don't forget to hit that like button. I hope you all have a great week in the market. Happy trading.